Review number two, review number two, coming at you, review number two. Hey, what's up guys, Goldie for Stuff and Things, coming at you with review number two for the day. Last night, my son and I made a extremely awesome choice to run to Walmart at really like almost midnight because the Brixie app was telling me that there was the six inch Thanos there and it's kind of been a trend as of now I've been seeing on a lot of message boards and a lot of Facebook uh, communities that uh, they're pumping them out uh, not only is the Thanos hitting the pallets the Infinity Gauntlet's hitting the pallets the, uh, the the riders are hitting the pallets the Infinity Wave is on those pallets but whatever man we scored and we got her there she is the Black Widow, and you know what, for a 39, I, it might have been 38 94 I don't remember, it was, you know, Walmart price, but either which way, for the price, it's a really cool little set, let's, let's get into this real quick, again, stuff and things, Johnny, uh, Johnny Golden tries to keep his reviews under five minutes, so we're gonna be fast here, so, number one, we got an extra head with the short hair, sculpt is real nice, like, it looks good, it's a new I believe it's a new sculpt. It doesn't look like a reuse for once. Thank you, Hasbro. That was very kind of you. Very kind of you. The bike, let's get into it. It's got a kickstand, which is pretty sweet. It goes up and down. If I could get it to go, there we go, up and down. The little back wheels got the uh, the little bouncy shocks. The front wheels kind of have a little shock to them, a little bit, minutely. Um, Widow's a nice figure. I believe she's a totally new sculpt. I'm going to take her off the bike for a minute. We're going to, we're going to, you know, show you a little bit of the articulation. So she's got the, uh, you know, she's got the cut up at the, uh, the thigh. She's got the double jointed knees, ankle rockers, uh, pivots, head is on a, uh, swivel and a ball joint, single jointed elbows. Think because of the motorcycle, she could have benefited for a double, from a double jointed, but you know, whatever. Um, good looking figure. Again, I believe it's a new face sculpt. I gotta say, it's, it's gotta be my favorite comic book Black Widow. Now, earlier this year, they did release a Marvel Vintage line, and they had a Black Widow in there. Here's a little comparison for you guys. A lot of guys are doing the head swaps on this one. I personally use the, uh, the red head from the, uh, the Jean Grey, or the Phoenix Cyclops 2-pack, the Toys R Us one. I like that head on it much better. But, uh, this is the original head, so you guys get a look. It's Mary Jane's head with more of a orangish hair. So it works for what it's worth, but uh, it's more of a classic look as you can tell. It's got that classic Black Widow look, and the new one's kind of maybe an upgraded, maybe a little bit more how she looks in the comics. I do like the long hair head, but in all necessary uh, for it to be necessary, the short hair head looks much better when she's on the bike. To be honest, it looks way more awesome. She you could get a better range of motion with the head. Um, the bike, you know, we got some clear plastic for the sculpting. The lights are sculpted. The wheels look real good. You got your disc brakes. It's got a little pretend chain. Like I said, kickstand. I mean, it's a nice, it's a really finely detailed little accessory. And it's nice that uh, Hasbro's doing stuff like this for us, for us, you know, collectors or even, even for the kids. I mean, at the end of the day, let's be honest, these toys are really for kids. We're grown men that run out to get them because we love them. They're little plastic representations of, of, of the Marvel Universe that we grew up with and we loved our entire life. And it's nice to have these little homages to what we love. And I mean, that's how I kind of explain it to my wife and it, it seems to work. But either which way, I love collecting my Marvel Legends. They're my favorite, my favorite action figure line out there. Hasbro's always doing a stellar job um it's 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 a, it's a beautiful set for for 39.99 you really can't beat it you know wait i think i hear something i think i hear another review coming at you later what 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 could that be i don't know but uh i'll do it myself goldie coming at you subscribe to my youtube channel subscribe to my uh my Facebook, Stuff and Things with John and Eric, uh, Stuff and Things and Friends is on YouTube. Um, you know, I'm going to throw a shout out to my boys at Mr. Wayne's because I love those guys. I was hanging out there the other day. If you haven't check, checked out Mr. Wayne's Pop Culture Collectibles in Westmont, please do. They're awesome. Those guys are fantastic. But uh, these things will be mass retail. Mr. Wayne's may be carrying them. I mean, stop in there. Say, hey, we'd like to we'd like to get a, a Black Widow set. And I'm, I'm sure, man, you know, Mike or uh, Joe could work with you. Those guys are fantastic. But like I said, you know, I, I kind of had to cheat on them and I feel bad doing so. I really do because they're my guys but you know it's it's the throw of the hunt and i think they understand that and i know you guys understand it there's just something awesome about hitting that store finding that palette of what you're looking for opening that uh, box yourself and, and and getting what you want you know it's it's the throw of the hunt and guys they're out there start hunting start hunting again goldie stuff and things reviews got some more coming at you later try to keep it under five minutes here we go Hoo -yah!